Okay. Hi friends. I am out in the middle of Lake Pepin. Can you believe it? So it's part of the Mississippi River. So to the north, the Mississippi flows down, widens out into Lake Pepin, and then continues on south. Over to the east is Wisconsin. You can see it's the town of Pepin where Laura Ingalls Wilder was born. She lived in that town way up in the big woods and on the bluffs of the town, those thick trees up there on the bluffs, that's the big woods. When Laura was two years old, Pa and Ma decided to take Mary and Laura over to Minnesota and they needed to cross this lake. So you, you know they didn't cross during warm weather when it was water. They had to wait till the winter when it froze. They crossed the frozen lake and now you can look at over and see the opposite shore is Minnesota. It's three miles to cross over to the lake. After they crossed over, that's when they went to Kansas, but they only stayed there about a year and a half until they came back. So in 1871, they made the trip back across the lake back to the little house in the big woods where they stayed about three more years and Pa got that itchy foot again. He wanted to travel. So they made the last trip back out in 1874 and they crossed the lake one last time. And at that point, then they stayed on that side. So I'm glad you could come and see Lake Pepin with me and Wisconsin and Minnesota. See you later, friends.